Oops. <laughs> I pressed E again because I've been playing too much art. Let me through the door. It's fine. Where are we? I think I know where we're going, but I could be wrong. Bodes well. Potential problem. What items do I have? Mm, this is a potential problem. It's a diary. I want to go back to that time. Things were so good then. The day for my birthday. The cute cat in the pet store. All those balls in the basket. Playing pool was fun too. The door of time was wide open. When I see four things, I can't help but remember that time. Cat balls. <laughs> Don't clip that. No one take that out of context. Cat. Basketballs. Pool. No, please. Oh. Eileen. Eileen. <gasps> oh, Eileen, run! Bruh! Bruh! No, 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 no! Eileen, run! Run, 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 run! Oh, Eileen! Eileen can mess a bitch up. She's got a police baton. The door's shut tight. It won't open at all. I remember this place. It looks a lot like downtown Ashfield. That's because it is, babe. There's three buttons set up vertically. Press a button, top button, middle button, bottom button. Top button. Fuck it. Sorry, I didn't mean to shove you, Eileen. I really, I didn't. I even have a pyramid head cup. In case y'all were wondering. It says, Greetings from Silent Hill. Come visit and you'll never be the same again. Alright. Goodbye. Doors shut tight. Okay. Okay, cool. <gasps> Ow. Oh, oh my. Run, Eileen. Eileen, run. Eileen, are you going to be there? You're not. Hurry, Eileen. I forgot about all of this. Oh cool, oh cool, oh cool, dogs. No! Oops. <laughs> Did I get her button mashing? Eileen, do something! Holy shit. Oh, I forgot. I can turn it down for me and keep it loud for you. Yes, I want the nutrition drink. I want to use a nutrition drink. Oh my god. I'm sorry, Eileen. I really don't mean to push you. You just happen to always be in the goddamn way. Oh, hey, look, another. Oh, girl, you are not looking good. Sure. 
There's also some sports supplies, but nothing particularly interesting. Hey, it's filled with volleyballs. I see that. Are you sure we don't want to do anything with it? Do you have any basketballs? Cake candles here? That's weird. Take the cake candles? Absolutely. I hate to admit it, Eileen, but you're looking kind of worse for wear. Oh! oh! Perfect. Just what I need. Now I can go back. Okay. Eileen, stay here. Safe and Eileen, what did I what did I literally what did I say? What did I say? Wakey wakey. I will. Thank you. I just heard someone walking in the apartment. Hey, Knoxville. Man is still jamming. I was wondering if this is when things go catty won't piss in if you can because I feel like things get weird out here at some point. But I guess not. Not yet. All right. Get this candle on the ready. What bullshit do I have to deal with out here? Besides the babies. Yeah, we're gonna put a stop to that. Immediately. Go away. I didn't even take the full candle. Can I pick my candle back up? <laughs> I would like to pick my Ooh! Hello. Continuing from yesterday, I'm going to summarize everything that I've learned about Walter Sullivan. Naturally, it was a long way for a kid his age to travel, but he made the trip every week by subway or bus. Unfortunately, someone else was living in this apartment, and so he couldn't be reunited with his mother, room 302. For years, he continued to come here, almost like he was possessed just to peek into the apartment. Eventually, the tenants began to complain and treat him badly when they saw him hanging around. Walter began to fear the tenants and see them as obstacles preventing him from seeing his mother. As the years passed and Walter matured, he began to be more and more influenced by the teachings of the cult. Furthermore, his obsession with his mother and his feelings of resentment towards the outer world became deeper. Walter became preoccupied with one particular tract from the cult's Bible, the Descent of the Holy Mother, the 21 Sacraments. By the 21 Sacraments, the Holy Mother shall appear in the countries of the world that shall bring salvation to the sinful ones. After Walter left Wish House, he moved to the Pleasant River, a town neighboring Silent Hill. For a while, he lived the life of a normal student, but he was still filled with the bitterness and resentment towards the rest of the world. Several years later, he launched his plan there, the 21 Murders. July 29th. Fascinating. Anyone hanging outside my door? Hi, Walter. You out here? The one time that he walked by and stared in the other room was so creepy. All right, listen, I don't remember what your ha your name is, Townsend or whatever the hell it is. I think I'm Townsend, but listen, I'm over it. So I'm going to stab you to the ground. I hope that you're okay with that. You, oh, I don't want this stupid club. Am I part of a private server on ASA? I am. Like my glasses? Thanks. They're just blue light glasses. I was having a wee bit of a headache today. I don't know if it's from not a lot of caffeine or not, but um, figured blue light glasses may be the play today.
Mm -mm -mm. And that is not coffee. That is literally chalky milk. Hi, Eileen. Where's our friend? I have a present for him. What the fuck is that? I, it, I think it's supposed to be a light, but it looks like lips and it's a giant head. Can I do something with that? I know. Oop, door. Okay. No, you know what? You know what? Oh, ew. What? Okay, cool. That's the only way to go. Goddamn mind. Oh, I left her there. <gasps> Whoa! Pick up the goddamn cat. Ugh. Let go of me! Good job, Eileen. Come on. I mean, run! No cool dogs. My guy. Good job, Eileen. I may have failed Eileen here, guys. Eileen might be dead. I'm currently looking for content creators for a survival ASA server if you might be interested in waiting in two hours if you are. I am not interested in playing any ASA tonight, but I appreciate you for asking. All right, let's go. I, I am already on a bunch of servers. We were doing so good with Eileen. We were doing so good. Of course. Thank you for offering. All right, Eileen. I haven't done right by you. You might die. <laughs> Right here. Lord have mercy. That where's mommy is very telling that Eileen is not good. We were doing fine before, but I think Oh, cool.
You're gross. Oh, cool, we're here again. I mean, I need you to just like not get hit. Because you were like on death's door, baby girl. And you dying, not great. The fact that she said, where is mommy? Not good guys, bodes poorly. Okay, well, this wasn't where I was trying to go, but this is where we ended up going. Are they ghosts? They are ghosts. All right, we've done the candles. We've done the candles and we've done the cat. So now we need to find basketball. Cool. Cole, help me. It's him. He's coming in. Oh yeah, you're not doing great. <laughs> um I have failed Eileen. And I haven't failed my husband. But I failed Eileen, but I haven't failed you. Circumstances. I guess we're doing pretty good, huh? Sure, Eileen. Let's go with that. Everything that just happened was bad. <laughs> Shut up, Eileen! <laughs> I know! Gosh. Dang it, Eileen! Eileen. Eileen, we're about to get jumped again. This is just as bad as what's the president's daughter's name from Resident Evil 4. Leon! Oh, hey. Yep, we're going to go down the ladder. At this point, if I die, I die. No. Gross. Oh, Eileen can't come down ladders. That's why she's not here. Hello? Hello? How cool, you guys? There's always goodies hid hidden past the weird tentacle worm things. Alright, goodbye. Yes. What's a cue ball doing here? Oh my god, are we gonna need a billion billiard balls? No. No. 
No. Time for this shit. Oh my god. I don't know what's happening. Walter. Walter Sullivan. It's time to complete the 21 sacraments. But that's my name. But what are the 21 sacraments? Don't worry. You'll know soon enough. Well, let's go and see Mother. Let me go, that hurts. Damn. What were you gonna do? What were you gonna do? Really? Don't smack me. Why are you This bug kills me, I'm gonna be so pissed. All right, knock, knock. Cool. No, not you! <sighs> Eileen. 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 Lots of cardboard boxes, but nothing interesting. A broken vending machine. Cool, a door I can open. Oh, I love the sound that's in here. Things are going fast. <laughs> oh, cool. I see you guys. Bye. This place is a gash dang maze. Nothing for me? Cool. Oh, candle. Billiard ball, a sword of obedience, ten pistol bullets and no gun, and a candle. <laughs> Don't forget my axe. Okay, we've got lots of doors down here. Oh my god, I didn't expect this one to open. Oh hey. Can I, um... Cool. Excuse you? Memo. Okay. The boss said he had to change our phone number because of all the complaints about the weird noises. Now we have to change the store sign on the roof. What a pain. By the way, the number is the last four digits of the new phone number. Not too smart, if you ask me. Ooh. I know what that means. Jazz. Kids like jazz. Wasn't there, a, I was gonna say, wasn't there a hole in the wall? Yes. Goodbye. I have to go look out a window and potentially burn a holy candle in my house to poo the demons. Ew, sorry. <laughs> sorry. Yeller. Yeah, I don't know why people don't like this game as much. Shut up. But people tend to not like Silent Hill 4 as much, and I'm not quite sure why. Um.
what happens if I call that? the code was for here because last time we came here the there was a code box here meow cool collapsed nope must the one was collapsed from above i think i can make it through No! These bugs kill me! No! I refuse! I am on death's door. Please give me a nourishment drink. I am begging on my hands and knees. How far down am I going? Basically just said, bye, Eileen. <laughs> to bring Eileen. Run, Henry. Gosh dang it. Okay, I'm back here. Back in the bogue infested place. I'm a lot like Lethal Company right now. Hi, Eileen. Missed you. I actually haven't. I have not missed you. I'm scared. Oh, she's looking veiny too. Oh, girl. <sighs> I didn't do right by you, Eileen. To be fair, I would also lose my shit. Um in a hellscape such as this. So I really shouldn't um, blame her. I can hear a sound of a clock from somewhere. The way she said it, I just would kill her so she didn't have to hear, the, didn't have to hear that again. That's the telltale sign that um, Eileen is injured in this game. So typically she doesn't say much. Um, if anything, if you leave her behind, she'll say to not go, not to go so fast. Um, but at certain points in the game, if you get her to talk and she sounds like she's talking like a child, that's when you know that she's taken a lot of damage. Oh, I'd love to see it. Um, gonna need a holy candle for that. If you'll excuse me for one moan. The evil is finding its way within my... Oh. Are these just here now? What happens if I get close to it? Oh. I don't go over there very often, so... <sighs> Things are not looking very good. Things are not looking good, people. Things are bad. Oh, 
listen, I don't know what you are. You're gross, and I don't want you in my house. Why? Fine. Be gone, demons. Be gone, thought. I don't remember seeing a clock. Huh. We're about to find out. We're about to run all over Hell's Green Acres. it in the bar? I don't remember where the clock is, guys. Oh god, Cynthia. Just keep running, just keep running, just keep running. Ah! Just keep running, just keep... Ooh. 